Okay, guys, two mighty King Kongs from Scott Island are here to join us in our awesome dress giant Jurassic World surprise egg opening. Cool. But behind them is the true treasure. Just a quick look behind the giant egg. These are Jurassic World toys that I went ahead and bought again because uh, Hasbro has lost the license as of June of this year. So, from now on, Mattel is going to be taking over the license, but I wanted to get all these toys new again because I really enjoyed them, guys. I mean, there have been a lot of complaints about the Jurassic World toys, but overall, I think they were awesome. Uh, some of them were cheaper quality, but they were a lot of fun. Okay, let's get to the giant surprise egg. Okay, first of all, this giant surprise egg was a movie souvenir that I ordered from Thailand. Okay, so the first giant surprise toy we are going to open up is not all that giant at all. But it is really cool. It's Walking with Dinosaurs, the 3D movie. And this guy makes sound. It says, hear me roar. So not, not really loud, but he is cool looking. This is Gorgon. And here is some fact. He is a Gorgosaurus. So... There's some facts on him if you want to pause it and read it. I believe that's English and Spanish. Cool. Let's check him out. Okay, so here is our Gorgosaurus. He looks cool and funny at the same time. I mean, it's... The paint job is really weird. It's like a gray undercoat with, like, shiny blue stripes on top. But, uh... Good movement on this guy. His head will turn 360. His neck will turn 360 independent. He opens his mouth way up. Uh, pretty decent uh, detail on the teeth there. Uh, his arms move. His legs move. And they're jointed at different spots. So they're jointed here. And they're jointed here. So this guy could do almost like ballet moves or something <laughs> look how he's running here <laughs> that would be hilarious okay and then uh okay it looked like his tail would move but i guess not ah uh, they did a really cool job they gave him really sharp shiny looking claws this is where you'd go ahead and put in the battery and let's listen to him without the box so not too loud, but, you know, it is a cool little toy. I mean, it reminds me a lot of uh, Takeratomi dinosaurs. And then we have another awesome Walking with Dinosaurs, the 3D movie toy. This is the Trudon. Let's go ahead and listen to that. Okay, so that's kind of uh, cool. It's not roaring. I mean, it's just sounds. But uh, it, I, I do like the sound. I just wish it was a little louder. And then here is some facts on him in English and Spanish. And here is the Trudon itself. It looks almost like wow, a giant feathered chicken or something. Okay, let's open it up and check it out. Okay, so here is our giant feathered chicken. He does make some cool sounds. Let's listen to him out of the box. <laughs> okay, and then let's go ahead and take a look at him because like I said, he is a giant feathered chicken creature so uh, he does move his head back and forth not 360 but a good amount 
his mouth does open and close. Not too much, but once again, a uh, decent amount. And then, moving on. Okay, this guy's got, uh, like, feathered arms. I mean, it looks almost like he could fly, but I kind of doubt that. But why he has feathers, I don't know what would be the purpose of the feathers. Besides, maybe to keep him warm. Huh, I don't know. And then, uh, feathers all down his back, his tail. Bunch of really fancy feathers there. Uh, feathers down his legs. Cool claws, cool looking leg, I mean feet. So, okay, this guy is pretty cool. I mean, I do like the feathered wings. It makes him look like, almost like a rooster. A giant man-eating rooster. And then the next cool dinosaur toy we pull out is the Glufosaurs from Dino Trucks. These are die cast metal. Uh, this guy almost looks like a Velociraptor. But you know, I'm not sure if he's good or bad. Okay, so he is class Dino Trucks. So that means he's a good guy. It says lightning fast and fiercely protective toward any trucks who get too close. Cool. Okay, so uh, I have reviewed a lot of Dino Trucks toys, guys. Uh, you could check out my Dino Trucks playlist. And it's a lot of fun. Let's go ahead and free him. Okay, I love how easy this is to free. One, one little uh, string there to snip. And this guy is totally free. Okay, so this is actually one of the coolest die-cast little dino trucks characters I've seen. He's even got a wheel on his tail there. So he rolls really cool. Oh, uh, okay, so this guy's supposed to be a Dilophosaurus, I guess. He's got the uh, frills here. So, first of all, I thought Velociraptor, but looking at this guy, definitely Dilophosaurus. He's got something come out, coming out of his mouth there. It almost looks like to spray something. So I guess this guy would spray stuff too, like uh, Dilophosaurus would spray poison. So I guess in Dino Trucks, he would probably spray something else. Uh, he's got treads on his legs. So here is... Oh, he does move his head all the way back. Cool. I like that. Look at that. It's almost like he's striking. So you could have him go... Oh, okay. You could move it by the tail. If you pull the tail, he moves his head back and forth like he's getting ready to spit. Because uh, if you've seen uh, the ones in Jurassic Park, I mean, they put their heads back and that's when they spit the poison. So, really cool character. Like I said, this is actually one of the coolest Dino Trucks ones I have seen. Oh, this one's fun. Coming out of the giant surprise egg is another one of these awesome packs of 15 Jurassic World miniature dinosaurs. Oh, I love these packs, guys. You can see it's totally sealed. So let's go ahead and cut this guy open. Cool. Uh, I've already reviewed quite a few of these, but guys, I like these so much. I mean, I bought, I think about 15 of these bags of miniature dinos because they're so cool and they are going to disappear. So let's see what we got in this one. Uh, they do have different paint jobs of the dinos and you get different number of dinos each package you open. As you can see, these are uh, packaged in these little triangles here. Uh, they package about half of them in the triangles to protect them. And uh, you're guaranteed to get at least one Indominus Rex per package. So I'm going to go ahead and free these guys and we'll check them out. Okay, so here they are all freed from the package. Let's go ahead and take a look at these one guy at a time. Sometimes you do get duplicates. I mean, some of these colors look familiar. But, you know, I, I love opening these uh, giant surprise packages and seeing what we got. So here we got a really cool 
Mosasaurus. And then we have a cool red T-Rex. Oh. Yeah, okay. I, I thought for a minute there he wasn't going to stand by himself. And I believe we have two red T-Rexes in this package. So you could have these guys battle each other. It's T-Rex first T-Rex in a ferocious battle to the death. Rawr. <laughs> or, and then we have a cool little brown and yellow Velociraptor. This guy looks really cool. Uh, what else we got? Oh, we got another T-Rex, a little brown guy. This guy is totally brown. I don't think I had a totally brown one before. I mean, I had green before. You can see the little JW logo there. Ah, cool looking Spinosaurus. I don't think I had this color scheme before. Because usually the ones they include are the, uh, it's like a golden metallic color. So it's really shiny. And this one is brown and black really cool looking and then uh stegosaurus which uh i've had this one before so this stegosaurus is really cool looking the jw logo okay here's one i don't believe i've had this is like a gray and silver stegosaurus really cool looking wow i like that if you guys get a chance to buy these little miniatures, guys, they're worth it. I mean, on Amazon, they are still selling them uh, for $15 a pack. So you get 15 cool little dinosaurs. Uh, if it's something you're interested in, I'll put a link below this video. So green and gray Triceratops. And then a cool Ankylosaurus. Uh, red. I've had that guy before. Okay, cool Indominus Rex. I mean, it looks almost like he's feathered, the spikes they have on the back. Great color job. They gave him red eyes and everything. But uh, I had that color scheme before. Okay, and then we have another uh, brown and black Spinosaurus. So that's cool. New color scheme, and they gave two of them. And then uh, Pachycephalosaurus. This one I had red before, but this is red with like a purple accent to it. So that is cool. And then we have uh, Dilophosaurus. And then we have uh, Dimorphodon. This one's brown, blue, black color scheme. So this one looks uh, familiar. And then a pterodactyl. Uh, I mean, I've had brown before, but this has like red color accents, so that is cool. Awesome. Okay, so that's the 15 dinos in the giant surprise bag. Okay, and the next thing we pull out. Oh, I like this egg. I, I love these uh, surprise like blind eggs and blind bags. Uh, I think they taped this one shut. Okay, let me go ahead and free him. Okay, so this one has a really cool, like, crystal, see-through purple egg. I like that. So these are 3D puzzles that you put together. So here we've got the body. Just go ahead and attach the head on this side. Snaps right on. And then on the other side, you're going to go ahead and... Huh, you know, it doesn't have a tail. Weird. Okay. Uh, I ran into that on one of these before, where it looks like it should have a tail, but it doesn't. And then you've got spikes for its back, and then you just go ahead and attach its legs. The rear legs are bigger than the front legs. So just remember, big legs in the back, small legs in the front, and you will do fine. And you just go ahead, snap it together, and you are all done. Awesome. So, I mean, he is weird looking not to have his tail. I mean, I don't know if they just forgot that or what. But, ah, uh, this is a cool looking uh, Stegosaurus. I mean, he is really evil looking. Check this guy out. Wow. 
Okay, and our next one is this awesome Dino Puzzle Egg. You could also buy these puzzle eggs on uh, Amazon. They come in 12 packs, and they are really cool. Let's go ahead and check out which one we got here. Oh, cool. Oh, I like that. That looks awesome. Okay, so this is, these are other uh, dinosaur puzzle eggs. The thing is, you could pull all of these pieces off. I think you get 21 pieces, but when you take it out of the egg, this is how it comes. So I'm just going to go ahead and put it together from this point so you can see what it will look like. And then you have, it's like the jaw. Oh. So you gotta put these together in the correct order or it's not gonna work. So you put the spikes there, then you go ahead and put in the bottom jaw piece. You slide it into there and then you're gonna slide in the top jaw piece with the third horn. Wow, that is cool! <laughs> Check that out! So 3D puzzle eggs. Wow. And then uh, let me let me actually just show you how many pieces these come apart in. Uh, they are a little bit more complicated to put together than the last one because they snap into so many different pieces. But it does come with a little set of instructions. So you could go ahead and look at the instructions how to put it together. But... As you can see, I mean, this guy is snapping into a lot of pieces. So these are, uh, you know, if you don't take it apart, they're not that complicated. I mean, uh, smaller children could put it together from the beginning, but after you take it apart, it does get a little complex. I mean, you've got like 21 weird looking parts here, which, have to put together but uh thankfully it does come with a nice little set of instructions and then we have another awesome dino puzzle egg uh this is a different kind it looks like they marked the spinosaurus so this must be a spinosaurus so a nice little egg not as fancy as the other one but uh these are kind of uh most of these are kind of cool to open you just squeeze the middle and then even if you don't want to cut it, most of the time, yeah, you could just pull it off just like that. And then here is your Spinosaurus. Cool. Let's go ahead and put them together and take a look at it. Okay, so this one, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and put its two parts of its head together. And then go ahead and push it right onto the body there. Okay, I was showing you guys the wrong end. I put his head where his butt goes. Okay, so this is the front end here. Then you'd go ahead and slide the head there. So now it's a lot more secure. And then you go ahead and put his arms. Uh, let's see. So, almost be easier if you took that off. You put his arms in here like this. And then you put this back on. That's the thing with these 3D puzzles. You have to pay attention to which pieces go first. Because if not, it's a lot harder to put together. And then there is the back of his tail. And then it looks like the legs are going to simply slide right into slots over there. And a slot over here. That is the coolest thing, guys. I love these 3d dinosaur puzzles check that out all these little pieces and it turns into an awesome little dinosaur that is so cool uh not much moving parts because if you move it he does tend to fall apart but there you have it an awesome 3d dinosaur puzzle and i do apologize guys this uh Stegosaurus, I showed you before, he does have a tail. 
Uh, it fell onto the floor and I did not see it. So you just go ahead, snap his tail on, and there he is, nice and complete. And then we have one more awesome dinosaur puzzle egg. So this is one of the cool ones. It's got, uh, it's almost got like a cracked texture on the egg, and it's a really good size egg. So, like the other ones, usually if you squeeze it and you pull it, it does come apart. And let's see. Hmm, I don't know what we got here. Well, I know we've got a lot of pieces. It looks like uh, a Patasaurus, judging by the head. Okay, so we have the body put together. I am not going to go ahead and take it apart right now. Uh, just like the other one I showed you, these do have like 21 pieces. And they are all interlocking. You can see like this one has a slot here. So you push it right into the slot there and it'll hold it nice and securely. And then you have to figure out, it looks like this is the front part. So, it's looking to me like this piece would fit on to here. Actually, see there, I was wrong. So it's this piece that fits onto there. Uh, you do have a set of instructions you could use to help you put this together. Because once you see all the pieces spread out, it does tend to get a little confusing. And then you have the neck joint here, which would have, which has this other piece here. And then you go ahead and connect the head. So the neck is actually like four different parts there. And then the leg pieces, like I said, it's got like a uh, almost like a hooked joint there. So you just go ahead and pull it right onto there. So that hook piece that comes down holds it in there nice and securely. And then you could either wing it, like try to find the right pieces here, or look at the instructions. For me, I tend to like winging it. It makes it more adventurous. So, okay, we're gonna go ahead and push that on there. And then it looks like this piece fits here. So if you could, just try to wing it guys I mean it's it's a lot more fun if you figure it out yourself it feels a lot more satisfying than looking at the instructions so just take all the different pieces put it together see what happens so uh, really cool I mean I love these surprise egg uh, like blind egg 3D and 4D puzzles, super awesome. Like I said, you could buy a box of 12 of these on Amazon. I believe it's about 30 for 12 of them, but they make great gifts. And our magic surprise egg has run out of surprises for today. So let's go ahead and close that. Like I said, that was a really cool uh, Jurassic World popcorn movie souvenir tub that came out only in Thailand so it was a really cool find on the internet okay guys so once again here is all the awesome Jurassic World dinosaur toys well not all but a lot of the Jurassic World dinosaur toys that were made by Hasbro brand new in their boxes Guys, I love making these videos for you. I mean, this is my job, and I love my job. So if you do like these videos, please go ahead, click like. Drop me a comment, guys. Uh, if you have suggestions on what you want to see, I do follow suggestions from a lot of my viewers. So, I mean, it, it this, this is totally fun. I mean, I love making these videos for you guys. Thanks for viewing, and I will see you tomorrow. Wow, guys, that was a lot of fun. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you click subscribe and the thumbs up button down below the video. And today's secret word is the word... Go ahead and put that in the comment section down below the video. I'll know you're a member of my club. You went to the video ends, there's an awesome end card. There's a lot more fun videos, and I will see you soon.
click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos and if you want to see even more go ahead and click the subscribe button.